On arrival at the site, Engineer Ife Jofo, alongside his permanent secretary and all the directors in the ministry, were taking round the 4.2 kilometer road to see things firsthand. Speaking after the inspection, Engineer Ife Jofo said that they had a serious challenge on the road, which he said has been resolved. Commissioner Ife Jofo regretted that the condition of the road has become so bad that some people can no longer come out of their homes and promised to create access roads for them while they resume work on the main road after the rains. He described Ndokeja as strong supporters of the Obiano administration, a reason why the governor felt concerned when he heard about their plight on the road. We had challenges, there were some challenges and uh, that's why we're here. And as you can see, the challenge has uh, put us in a very bad shape. But as engineers, we are born to solve problems. We are going to give them a relief. On his part, the assistant managing director of the firm handling the project, Mr. Iken Nachuku, appreciated government for responding promptly to save the situation. He explained that they left the site following threats from members of the community on his workers but promised to move back to site now that the issue has been resolved. What made us to pull out was because of the issue that the, the security of the lives of our staff were threatened. Uh, apparently, the community had land issues with some people known to them. But uh, our workers were attacked, our equipment destroyed, and we had to pull out for safety concerns. From Nkwa Umuhu, Ubahuezike Road Project, Okeja, in Ihiala Council area, I am Ngozi Obileri for ABS News.